Uy, lambo jeep niyan, dumi-dumi mo na, punasan mo na kita. Grabe. Alam mo ba, lambo jeep ni, meron na akong nakita sa internet ngayon, sa social media na issue. Yung last daily, kilala mo ba yon Tsaka si Project Nightfall. Di ba, alam mo, close ako, kila Apo Wangkod, tsaka sa Kalinga, sa lahat, kahit anong tribo ng Kalinga, mahal ko ang mga tao doon at mahal nila ako. Alam mo ba, nakakabismaya, Lambor Chick, ito si Nas Daily, kung di mo alam, pero yung mamuntuy ganyan, actually, niloko niya pala si Apo Wangkod, hindi lang muntikan. Babayaran niya raw si Apo Wangkod sa halagang 750 pesos dahil sa Nas Academy para kapalit nito, i-share ni Apo Wangkod ang tradisyon ng pagtatato ng pambabatok at itituro daw ni Nas Daily sa Nas Academy. Tama ba yun? O? Oh, talaga? Grabe naman pala yan Nas Daily na yan. Tsaka yung Project Nightfall scammer pala yung mga yan. Grabe. Kawawa naman sila Apo Wangkod. Di ba si Apo Wangkod eh isa na sa natuturing na bayani na rin natin at national treasure ng Pilipinas dahil sa tradisyon na kanyang hawak Diba? Sa pambabatok at sikat siya sa buong mundo. Oo. Oh, oh. Tama ka doon. Ang galing mo rin pala lambor jeep. Nila mo rin pala yung mga bagay na gano'n, no? Abay, syempre naman. Talagang alam ko yan. Syempre, kanino pa ako nagpanay? Hindi sa amo ko. Oh. Hey, nakakatouch ka naman pala lambor jeep. Magre-react lang ako sa glit, ha? Tungkol sa nangyaring issue, paupo muna ako sa'yo lambor jeep. Okay lang. Sige, sige. Upo ka na sa akin at mag-English ka para maintindihan ni Nastelia. Akala niya ang mga Pilipino hindi marunong mag-English. Oo nga, yun nga yung naging dahilan. Kasi nagkamali sa interpreter. Kumbaga, scam ang nangyari. Uy, Lambor Jeepney, umuulan. Punas ako ng punas sa'yo. Sa loob na lang ako ng bahay, magre-react ka. Sige, sige, sige. Baka magkasakit ka pa. Kalingan mo ang magre-react mo ha. Magtangkol mo ang payan ng kalinga. Okay, sige, sige. Let's go! Yo, what up mga kaungas? So, medyo na-dismaya lang ako sa iba bahagi kasi nyo, tingnan nyo. Nagtanong pa ako kay Lambor Jeepney about my reaction about here. Lingin sa inyong kalaman, nakulong ako sa Kalinga for 2 years and 1 month. And bago nun, syempre, na-experience ko ang kanilang kultura at kanilang tradisyon dyan sa Kalinga. Unang muna i-share ko sa inyo, etong pambabatok. Ang pambabatok ko ay tradisyon ng mga taga-Kalinga na pag nakakita ka ng mga lalaking may tatu, at maraming tatu ibig sabihin marami ng laban ang naipanalo ang lalaking yon at etoy marka ng mga taong kanilang nakitil na ang buhay which is totoo po yon at sa mga babaeng maraming tatu sa pambabatok dito sa Kalinga ito po ay ibig sabihin ay kagandahan kaya po si Apo Wangod ay napakaganda sa kanilang tribo dahil napakarami niya pong tatu pag marami pong tatu ang mga kababaihan sa kanila, eh mas maganda ka. Eh bakit po ako nagre-react ng ganito sa nangyaring ano ni Nas Daily? First of all, Nas Daily, okay, this, this message is directly to you. You don't know how kind these people are. You took advantage on what they have. It is the part of the history of Kalinga tribes that pambabato it will not cost them for 750 pesos in exchange with the knowledge of that tattoo art or the way, the skills, and the education on how to do it for only 750 pesos. You didn't think very widely, my man, Nastail. With all due respect, I do respect you, all of your contents. It has a lot of knowledge, right education, but I was dismayed because of this issue that you had with our beloved country, especially to one of our national treasure, and we consider her as a hero, Apu Wang Ud, because she's one of the living legends right now who gives pride to the Philippines. It heartbreaks me when I heard that you scammed our beloved countryman, Apu Wang Ud. Why? Only for 750 pesos you offered and she didn't understand what is the dealing all about and you are trying to put the way, the tradition, and the culture of the Kalinga, especially the Butbut tribe in your Nas Daily Academy. How selfish you are, my man. 
that is an act of selfish. And also, you Project Nightfall, don't save a face, man. You know, you know for the fact that both of you are together with this scenario. Don't try to clean your name. But of course, I will be focusing on Nas Daily. What have you done, my man, to the Philippines? Did you ever think that Philippines is one of the most watchers here in Facebook, YouTube, in any kind of social media? I'm telling you, man. I'm telling you. I guess 30% of your viewers are purely Filipinos and for you also, Project Nightfall. Guys, why did you act selfish? And you also underestimated the Kalinga men. I'm telling you, be thankful that they accepted you as a visitor and a guest in their place. For your information and for your knowledge, they are well known as a head hunters. Kalinga. You know what I mean by head hunters? It's part of their tradition of uh, in Kalinga, they are so brave, the tribal wars. Until now, it's part of their culture of killing someone. They are real headhunters. That's why lucky for you, you were, you were accepted as a guest, as a visitor in Kalinga. Be grateful about it, my man. And also, Apu Wang Ud is a very beautiful woman with her age and a very kind person. Why have you took advantage about this lady, my man? I'll speak in Tagalog so that my fellow countrymen will understand everything, okay? Kasi po, ito po ang nangyari. Sa halagang 750 pesos daw. Ipagpapalit sa diling, ipagpapalit ni Apo Wang Ud ang kultura, tradisyon ng pambabatok. Hindi ah, masyadong ina-underestimate nitong si Nas Daily. You know what? Nas Daily, let me speak again in English. 750 pesos a month is just a coin in Kalinga. Do you want me to tell you honestly? Kalinga is one of the richest places here in the Philippines. They just chose to live in the mountains. They got a lot of resources. Money, 750 for a month. Let me get straight to the point. They can give you at least 750 pesos a day. Not only that, they can double and triple that money. You cannot bribe Kalinga people for 750 pesos in exchange with their culture and tradition. Just being straightforward. I know you are a great man. But we want to hear your explanation. Why have you done such terrible thing? Especially to the country of Philippines. Filipinos are the most hospitable people all over the world. You know it for the fact. Even though we, you have visited the bravest place in the Philippines, Kalinga. They are the headhunters. Let me show you. Let me show you. It is tattooed here in my right arm. The map of Kalinga. And I got this tattoo when I was in jail. Okay. If you will see the ship, this is the map of Kalinga. And you see this X mark? Show it closer to the camera. Do you see that? You see that X mark? That is the place of Buscalan. And if you will see the words in here, it is written, Land of Prosperity. That's why I am so triggered to make this reaction because the whole place of Kalinga, I love it. I love it. I give respect to the people. And through all the years, I stayed there for two years and one month. My life, was been molded into a better person. I was able to learn from their, their culture. I was able to interact with their tribe, daily different kinds of tribes, and they are all friendly. Why? That is my question, Nas Daily. Why? Are you that really desperate or hungry for success that you have plotted a very ingenious act of greediness, of stealing someone's culture and tradition. 
Man, that is a total insane move. See? See how it goes right now? A lot of people are really mad at you. You got bad comments. You got a lot of bash. It is because you didn't think widely, my man. You underestimated the intelligence of the Kalinga people. I'm telling you, they are one of the smartest Filipino here in the Philippines. And they are one of the bravest. Actually, they are the bravest, I'm telling you. It's still part of their culture, the tribal war. You know what? They just only have this budong, which give peace in each and every tribe. Lucky for you, you... You weren't able to experience the tribal war. It is really messy and bloody, my man. So give respect to all Kalinga people and give respect to the tribe of Apuwang Ud, Butbut tribe. I will really expect that you will have your explanation and your video of apology saying sorry directly to Apuwang Ud. Because I will not stop fighting for Kalinga people until you will make your apology video. Ah, I don't want to curse. I don't want to say any, any bad words, you know. It's been rough to me these past four months that I have. I was able to be back here in Facebook because I was banned because of my cursing, negative words, and toxicity. Toxicity. I don't want of all those that toxicity anymore. Nas daily and Project Nightfall. I hope both of you will say apology to all the Filipino nation because you owe us. Really, literally, thirty percent of your viewers. Not only maybe more than that, maybe fifty percent of your viewers and community of your channels are Filipinos, and I'm I'm very confident about it. I'm pretty sure. We are, we Filipinos are the most viewers all over the world. What do I mean by that? We Filipinos love social media. Time to time, we check our social media. So don't be hypocrite, my man. Like you, Project Nightfall, telling that to all the people who want to unfollow, then unfollow. I'm telling you, once Filipino nation unfollow your channels, man, your channels will not be stronger enough to stand it anymore again. So, mga kababayan, pasensya na kayo sa mga nasabi ko, ha? Ang gusto ko lang kasing sabihin, napakabait sa akin ng buong kalinga. Naramdaman ko yun, na-experience ko yun. Sa dalawang taon at isang buwan, nakasama ko ang iba't ibang klaseng tao na taga kalinga. Na nakasama ko rin ang mga kamag-anak ni Apo Wang Ud at kilala ko ang mangilan nilan sa kanila. At si Apo Wang Ud mismo ay namit ko na ng personal. Hindi lang ako nang papapicture nun kasi I want to keep it private. My experience with them is totally private. Sobrang napakalapit ko sa mga tao ng Kalinga. Kaya sana, mga kababayan kong Pilipino, si Apo Wang Ud po ay isa sa mga tinuturing nating national treasure at kilala siya sa buong mundo. Daig niya pa ang Hollywood star dahil talagang celebrity ito. Living legend, kumbaga. Kaya sana, suportahan natin ang buong kalinga at ang kanilang tribo na butbut. Ito ang masasabi ko sa'yo, Nas Daily, Aratcha User! Alam mo yon Salita nila yon Sa tribo nila. Aratcha User, Nas Daily. Yun lang. So maraming maraming salamat mga kaungas. Ayan o. Oh. Nagkaroon ako ng tattoo kahapon Dito sa Angela City Binisita ako Ng mga taga Butbut tribe At nakuha ko itong Luru Na tinatawag nila Ayan Naka Nakasulat I got ink in Buscalan Pero I got ink in Angela City Tara Baka maging proud na sa akin si Lamborghini nito dito. Tara Uy Lamborghini Nasabi ko na yung sa loobin ko Tungkol kay Apo Wang Ud Dinalingan ko dun Tala ka ba? Ginalagyan mo? Talaga nag-English ka? Baka mamaya tumubo ilong mo ha? Hindi, alam mo naman ako, di ba? Witty to, kahit papano. Oh, 
Oh, po muna kaya kita pinunasan ha. Sige, umupo ka after mo mag-react kulit dito. Maligo ka naman. Maligo-ligo din. Ang baho mo na. Grabe ka naman magsalita alam mo, JP. Alam mo, love na love naman ko ito eh. Kaya nis ka, paupo ako ha. Aray! <laughs> Tatampo yata si Lambor Jeepney. Yan! Ulag ka kasi! Sinabi sa'yo, taan-taan lang! Umupo ka! Okay, okay, Lambor Jeepney. Paupo ako. So, ayun guys. Ha? Ako, naging viral ako. One of my viral videos is in Kalinga. Kaya ako sumikat na, you wanna know why? Diba Lambor Jeepney? Oh, malaki talaga ang utang na loob mo sa kalingka At talaga minahal ka ng mga tao doon Kaya talaga ipagtanggol po sila Kapag sila ay niloloko Alam mo naman tayo Lambor Jeepney, natural sa atin yan Ang pagtatanggol sa mga inaapi Kaya, Nas Daily I hope You had Your lesson now And you will stop Stealing Other people's culture Especially the traditions. It's okay for you to make some contents on different places of the world as long as you will not harm their culture, traditions, and the way of their living. So yun lang mga kaungas, no? Kung hindi nyo alam bakit ko ginagawa itong video ng ito, talaga napakalapit ng puso ko sa mga tao ng Kalinga. At doon ako talagang nakilala kaya kung alam nyo bakit ang channel ko is you wanna know why try to make a research doon ang viral video ko na may hawak akong pabalo na laman ay kalamansi at nagsasabing you wanna know why so sa mga tao sa Kalinga mega shoutout sa inyo sa mga tropa ko dyan maraming 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 salamat sa pag-aalaga sa akin. So anytime soon sana pag natapos tong pandemic season na to, mabisita ko ulit ang mga tropa ko sa different tribes of Kalinga. Utang na loob ko po sa kanila rin ang YouTube channel ko. Wala in party po sila ng istorya ng aking YouTube channel ko. Kaya kung wala sila, wala rin ako dito. Kaya sumasakit ang loob ko sa mga taong katulad nito si Nas Daily at ni Project Nightfall na kumbaga nag-take advantage sa tao ng Kalinga na napakabait ng mga tao at in ang kanilang pagkatalino hindi alam na itong dalawang taong ito na si Nas Daily at si Project Nightfall na napakatalino ng mga taga Kalinga napakabait at makatao sila so yun lang mga kaungas no? ang dami mo naman sinasabi dyan bisitahin mo na kasi mga tropa mo sa Kalinga huwag ka naman bigla sumisingit dyan number jitney oo nga pala sa lahat ng mga tropa ko dyan sa Kalinga Anytime soon, matapos lang itong pandemic na nararamdaman natin. Alam nyo, napakaraming yung tropa dyan. At si napakarami, bibisitahin ko kayo isa-isa. Kasama ito si Lambor Jeepney. Unahin muna natin mga tropa natin sa mga panorte. Siyempre, malayo-layo yun sa inyo. Anyway, abangan nyo ako dyan. Lalapag din ako sa Kalinga. Tsaka magpapasalamat ako sa mga tao talaga na nasa likod ng aking paglaya. So maraming maraming salamat sa inyo mga kaungas. Stay tuned. Don't hate, spread love and educate. Supportahan natin at protektahan natin ang tribo ng Kalinga. So let's go!